Welcome everybody, this is your boy Dryden Matoto, and we are here with another Grand Theft Auto V PC modding tutorials. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button, and if you're new here, subscribe for more daily gaming content, and we gotta get straight into the video. Welcome back guys, this video is all about on how to install your design apartment but we're going to call it the Wii's GNZ apartment all you guys are going to do is download and install all the requirements that's in some of the description below and make sure that your requirements is the latest version make sure you do install map builder if you don't know how to install map builder there is a tutorial in some of the description below so go and check that out so guys, once you guys have completed that process, then all you guys got to do next, okay, is download the mod. I'll leave this mod in some of my description below too as well. Once you guys have completed that, then we're going to get straight into the process. Now, all you guys got to do is open up your design new apartment extract folder. Now, inside that extract folder, there's a few files in here, okay. So what we're going to do, okay, guys, is that we're going to go to our... Uh, YMAP folder, then now uh, click on your design apartment folder. Make sure that there's a DRC.RPF file inside there. Go back once, then now uh, go back to your Grand Theft Auto V game, hover over it, right click, and open file location. Now, as you guys can see, I have already installed my requirements, so make sure you install your requirements as well. Now, now, all you guys got to do is go to your Mars folder, go to your updates, go to Time64, go to DRC packs, and then, as you guys can see, I have already got one there, so I'm just going to replace it, okay? And replace, there you go. Now, all you guys got to do, okay, is go back to your main Grand Theft Auto V folder, then now go back, and then now all you guys got to do next, okay, just go to your menu folder and now click on apartments and click on apartment Franklin now uh, go back to your Grand Theft Auto V game folder go to your menu stuff go to Spooner and now as you guys can see I have already got one there so all you guys gotta do is click on your apartment.xml file and drag it inside your spooner. I've already got, yeah, I've already done not, done mine. Now go back to your extract folder, okay, and open up your readme.txt file. Now inside your readme.txt, all you guys got to do is find the code, the DRC list code, and the DRC list code is over here. Copy the code over here, guys. Copy it. And now exit out of your out of your text file, exit out of your extract folder, and then now go back to your Grand Theft Auto V main folder, right click refresh your folder, and now exit out of your game folder, open up your open IV, and then now all you guys got to do next is go to your Grand Theft Auto V windows. Now all you guys got to do next is wait for a few seconds. It all depends on your PC performance. Click on edit mode, select yes, go to mods, go to update, go to update.rpf, go to common, go to data, and then scroll right down the bottom until you, you see, until you see drclist.xml, hover over it, right click, and edit. Then I scroll right down the bottom, and then paste it over here, guys, see, but as you guys can see, I have already got one there, so I don't need to paste it, okay? So just paste it over here guys, down the bottom, okay? And then save it. Then go back to your DRC list.xml. Double click and then check to see if it's there. Designer apartment, yes it's there. Close the application, click on edit mode, click on GTA V, close your open IV, then right click on your desktop, refresh your desktop and then I'll see you guys in the game. Welcome back guys, we are here with Franklin and now we are going to go and see what the apartment looks like, okay? So press F8, go down to Object Spooner, 
and then go down to manage save files then go down to apartments press enter once and then go down to load placements now this will take about a few, a few seconds five seconds and now we are here now what we're going to do guys is that we're going to go and uh, get a car to test this garage to see if it works so let's go and get a car any car sorry lady i will give you your car back soon now just come over here guys and this is where your apartment is your apartment is at the location where michael DeSanto's house is so yeah so just go over here guys and you'll teleport in and there you go see guys this is your garage right here wow so i have tested this mod okay this mod can actually have 10 about 10 vehicles in here um three on this side two at the back and one at the back right at the back over there so that's about three four five six up uh, uh, about six and now over here we've got a computer we've got some mechanical stuff over here that's pretty convenient and over here this is where the wee g's and Zen boys can just sit there and have, have a few beers and uh, watch some um, YouTube or play some games while they're drinking or watch some rugby and yeah or watch some nipple <laughs> and they can put all their cars in here all of their pink cars in here and now uh, to go outside you can just walk out there or you can walk in here now all you got all you guys gotta do is just walk straight in and now this is Weezer's apartment. Nice. So you can come over here, just kick back over here, and then now stalk Michael DeSantis' daughter or whatever. Um, uh, and you can come over here and oh my oh jeez Weezer, you got some pictures in here. What do you have? So this is his house, okay, guys. Wow, look at that man. Now we go well. Um, see guys, all oh, this is stolen, guys. Okay. Oh, jeez, where did you get that stuff from me? You're stealing too much thing. So, this is his, um, his sofa. Uh, what this? From 1929. Uh, what are you, why are you reading this? Jeez. Oh, so, yeah, this is his sofa. He just comes over here, sits down, read his book, and then, uh, uh, uh stopped at, um, Michael Descender's daughter. Uh, and over here, this is where he put it, put his keys and a suitcase and his alarm there as convenient. And over here is his lounge. Hmm. Uh, we've got some stuff over here. So we got a Game Boy over here. I mean, the Nintendo. It looked like, looked like. And we got a bong here. This is the bong. This is the bong over here, and we got a bong here. Yeah, we can have some smokes, and over here is uh, uh over here is the hallway. You can come over here and have have a few drinks and champagne. And this is another hallway to that side, so that's, that's convenient. And over here is the best part, which is the kitchen. Uh, the kitchen is over here. You can have some spots over here on the stove. Uh, and this is the fridge. And his sink where he can wash his bottles. And uh, uh, over here is his table. Uh, yeah. Table of just a blank table. Over here is, um, is his champagne shelf. Yeah. And over here, what's over here? Oh, yeah, yeah, chat, chat, chat. And over here is Weezy's and Zed's office. But yeah, this is his office, guys. Um, uh, but watch out! Don't look at his history because uh, there's some R18 over there. <laughs> so yeah, uh, this is his office, guys. That's what his office looks like. It's convenient. I like it. But um, but guys, I'm going down there last because guys, down there is the most awesome part of the mansion. So I'm gonna go there down there last. Now over here, guys, is the bedroom. Oh, oh my gosh, Weez, what are you doing to these dogs? Oh my gosh. 
Hey! So I need to spot the gods. Uh... Oh, jeez. There's a spot to you. Now, we got some cheers over here. We got like, a big ass TV over there. Some DJ and music area over there. This is the best part that I like to guys is a walk in wardrobe. We can um, put on his um, snapbacks and his basketball dunk gear and his basketball t shirt. He can, he can watch some TV while he's in his wardrobe. Now, guys, this is the best part of the mod that I like it, okay? It's this part over here. Now, I never seen in real life a, a bathroom and a toilet like this guy. So, here we go. This is a bathroom, hashtag toilet, hashtag shower. I don't know what you can call it. So, here we go, guys. This is the awesome. See, so guys, look at, look at this, man. A toilet over there. And now, you can put all your toilet rolls up here. And some smellies up there. And over here, you can just kick back over here. And, and over here too, you can watch your TV too, while you're just uh, taking a dump. Oh, jeez, we need to flush your toilet, man. I can see something, man. Over here, we can uh, decide to sit here and now uh, do your makeup or your hair. Oh, gee, I can see some... Look at your jeez. I can see some, uh, some skid marks. So over here, um... Uh, Weez and Weez and his girls can just suddenly sit there and uh, relax and then uh, oh, enjoy the life of the rich side, you know, and watch some TVs, watch some Netflix and chill. And over here, this is a big ass shower, man. Look at the shower, man. How many people you can fit in here? Sheesh, Jared, brother. How many people you can fit in here? About 10 people. Imagine just sit just standing in the middle and you have ten ladies around you. Oh, you'll be the lucky man. <laughs> if I was there, I would just lie down and just let them do their job. <laughs> so yeah, over here guys, we got a bathroom, toilet, shower, um uh jacuzzi and etc. in this area. So let's go outside here guys. And we finished the bedroom area. Now, we are come, going to go over here, guys. This is the best part of the mansion, too, guys, is this area down here, downstairs. Now, go downstairs, guys, okay? Now, over here is a games room. Games room, hashtag kickback room. You can, over, uh, over here is the games room, hashtag kickback room. So, you, so, yeah, you can just only kick back over here with your boys. Just only joke around and uh, just only talk and play some cards or whatever. And over here you can play some pool table with your boys. Over here you can bring up your laptop and uh, play some Fortnite or some uh, GTA or whatever you want to play. Or some Apex Legend. And over here you can play some PlayStation games. So that's convenient. That, that is pretty cool. I like this room. And I like the color. Well, I don't really like the color, but I like the way the color blends in. You know? I don't really like the color because I like red. Now, over here, we got some drinks that actually work. You can drink. Now, this is the best part, guys. I really like it. These two areas over here. Now, as you guys can see by the, by the sign up there, this is a swimming pool over there. So, over here, guys, this is the best part. The reason why this door is the best part because I'm going to show you guys now. But the only way to make it the best part is to turn down the lights. So I'm going to turn down the lights, guys. Time. I'm going to turn down the lights. Two zero. Now, guys, here we go. I like this one. This is a basketball court. Look at that, guys. See, well. You even got your time score up there too. You can play basketball with your boys. And now you can have all your ladies up there cheering for you. Uh, you got your bags over here. Some Eddie Dex bags. So, that's, that's, so this basketball court is really awesome. I like it, man. I really, really like it. And I like the lighting up there too. It's pretty cool. Now I'm going to turn the lights back on. For the swimming pool. Now the lights are back on, guys. 
Now over here we've got a swimming pool over here. Look at and guys look at the swimming pool. It's one of the best swimming pools ever, man. So over here we've got a swimming pool over here. Uh, we just can just only have a have a swim over here by himself or with, with his friends or boys or family or girls. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, this is this is the swimming pool area, guys. And over here we've got a jacuzzi spa pool. This is one of the biggest spa pool, man. I like this spa pool. Now, right now, guys, in New Zealand where I live, uh, it is quite cold, right, right here. And the it's really, really cold. And I wouldn't mind jumping in there right now. Now, over here is the gym area, hashtag resting area. And I'm guessing this is a shower for the pools. Yep, yeah, it is. The shower is over here. So yeah, guys, I I showed you guys all of Weezer's house. But yes, guys, um, I am thinking of using this mod for one of the GTA V real life mod videos. Okay, but yes, guys, I know I am I am trying my best to bring that video up. Okay, uh, but just give me time. Okay, more and more time. So guys, I'm gonna go and try and get out of here. And we are back guys, so I hope you guys did enjoy that video. If you guys did, then uh, comment below on what you guys like about it. And don't forget guys, if you do get stuck installing this mod, then please comment below. And I'll be more than, more than welcome to help you guys out. And if you guys have any problems with any other mods, then let me know in the comments as well. So with that I said guys, I hope you guys do enjoy that video. If you guys did, do smash that like button and subscribe for more daily gaming content and tutorials. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Thank you for watching. Peace and I'm out.